सो गाइज बस आप एम बैक विद इन दीडियो सो बिफोर आई स्टार्ट दिस वीडियो आई वॉन्ट थैंक यू ऑल फ्रॉम द बॉटम ऑफ माई हार्ट दैट यू रियल लाइक माई एप वर्कआउट यू नो आई एम गेटिंग डी एम्स ऑन इंस्टाग्राम एंड ऑन वेट्सएप दैट यू डन वेरी ग्रेट जॉब देर सो आई रियली जस्ट थैंक यू फॉर बींग सपोर्टिव टू माई गाइज माई ऐप वर्को सर्किट ऑफ दिस वीक हैज़ बीन फिनिश्ड बिकॉज आई ट्रेन एप्स अबाउट थ्री टू फोर टाइम्स अ वीक सो आई लेफ्ट विद माई काफ वर्कआउट एंड माई आर्म्स So I'll be training arms and calves today. So let's get it on with it. Well, here I have two five kg dumbbells and a fucking resistance band, but I have to manage with this only guys because uh, there are no excuses for the fucking picky fucking blinders. So our first exercise would be bicep curls, which I have done with resistance band. And the muscles targeted by bicep curls are bicep brachii, which we have in Latin that reference to. टू हेडेड मसल ऑफ दी आर्म और इसके साथ बाईस ब्रैकिया के साथ साथ हमारे दो और मसल होते हैं आर्म में जो साथ साथ एक्टिवेट होते हैं दैट इज ब्रैक्यूलिस एंड ब्रैक्यूरेटलिस जो ब्रैक्यूलिस होती है वो हमारे अपर आर्म में होती है दैट हेल्प्स इन द इट इज अ प्राइमर एक्चुअली इट इज अ प्राइमर मूवर ऑफ अवर एल्बो फ्लेक्शन यू नो दैट व्हेन वी फ्लेक्स दिस हियर दिस इज वेयर द ब्रैक्यूलिस यू कैन फाइंड आउट एंड द ब्रैक्यूरेटलिस इज इन अवर फोर यूजुअली इन अवर फोर आर्म्स वेल दिस इज अनदर टॉपिक यू नॉट गोइंग टॉक अबाउट इट सो बाइसेप कर्ल्स जो है हमारे बिगर आर्म्स को बिल्ड करने में बहुत हेल्प करता है it provides strength and uh, to our wrist to our forearms and to our biceps also and it is the most common and effective way of building bigger biceps so guys my second exercise will be dumbbell curls it provides us muscle definition ready muscles of the biceps are instantly affected by this exercise and the fat in our upper arm is reduced by this or cut down by this exercise Well, it is a full arm movement from our elbow, and it will allow us to work on our lower muscles of our forearms too. The standing and reverse curls provide us more strength to our arms. So, strengthening our arms would benefit us in lifting our bench press, our shoulder press, and our deadlift too. Since the movement is so easy that it will impact directly on our biceps, and it will not gonna make us lose our more energy than uh, as compared to the bicep curls, and it will make us do more reps. so while performing dumbbell curls i suggest you to have proper weight not much heavy weight than usual because you don't want to lift weight like this or this this will not going to affect your bicep and this will not going to make any result that we have is reverse curl a reverse curl helps us in our gripping strength it gives strength to our uh, wrist also and uh, we have the most common delicate uh, part of our uh, joint is this wrist joint because people usually don't train wrist so i will suggest you to do reverse curls this joint is very important while lifting whether you're lifting deadlifts whether bench press or whether shoulder press or while doing bicep curls also The last exercise for my bicep workout is hammer curls. It is an isolation exercise, and it helps building our arms, usually the upper part of the bicep, and uh, it provides strength to wrist also. While it having it is it has a neutral grip, so it is easy for us to have some more heavy weight while doing hammer curls. But I again suggest you to have a neutral weight. I mean, just a proper weight that you can do more reps with it. I don't want you to have a fucking heavy weight and do you are doing your hammer curls like this or like this. This is not gonna affect your arms though.
So guys, let's talk about our tricep workout now. Well, usually tricep uh, are termed as three head muscles of our arm. That is the lateral, the medial, and the long head of the triceps. So first exercise would be skull crusher. Well, your skull is not gonna crush by any how, bro. Fortunately, due to our triceps. Well, the muscle targeted by skull crushers are the lateral and the long head of the triceps. So the second muscle that is targeted by skull crusher is latissimus dorsi, that is lats. Also, they, also when performing this exercise, there is a tension in our upper chest that uh, stabilizes our upper body while performing this exercise lying down on the floor. So the second exercise for triceps workout is push down. It is an isolation exercise and it targets our medial and the long head of the tricep. And the secondary muscles that are targeted by push down are our abs, oblique, chest, our lats and it helps us in stabilizing the motion of the push down. Now we're gonna do dips guys. Dips is one of my favorite exercises for tricep guys because because when I used to play Wushu, yeah, you may know that. I am a national Wushu player guys. Since in my childhood I used to play Wushu and uh, Wushu is just like martial art, Muay Thai. It is a fighting combat game. Well, I'll talk about it later. So let's get back to our content. So while uh, dips is one of the most lovable and most common exercise that most athletes do to get their tricep toned because it is uh, it is not for bulking guys it is just for getting your uh, definition and tone in your arms dip strength of a primary muscle that is tricep and secondary muscles like shoulders and our chest So guys, our last exercise for tricep is kickback, and the kickbacks are usually for the definition and strength and tone. It is not for bulking. It gives definition to the tricep and it forms up the tricep brachii, the tricep brachialis, and the pronated areas. Kickback hits the upper part of the arm, that is from elbow to the shoulders, or we can say that the long head of the tricep. So this is the arm workout that I'm following right now guys so you have any query related to anything you can DM me on my insta I am attaching my insta profile link in the description of this video so if you like the video do tell me in the comment section about the video and who hasn't subscribed my channel subscribe guys